Chris Rufo, the one and only guy, he's been invaluable, hasn't he, in this whole critical race theory fight and so on. He got a hold of some absolutely insane comments from Disney's top executives in an internal meeting. Uh, and take a listen to one of them. This is Carrie Burke, who is the president of Disney. I'm, I'm here as a mother of, of two queer children, actually, um, uh, one transgender child um, um, and one pansexual child, um, and and also as a leader. Um, one of our execs stood up and said, you know, we only have a handful of queer leads in our content. And I went, what? I, that can't be true. And I and I and I realized, oh, it, it actually is true. And I hope this is a moment where shoot um the 50 percent of the tears <laughs> sorry <laughs> are coming um uh we don't we just don't allow each other to go backwards yeah so disney and she have apparently made clear that they are going to be putting as many you know the acronym they use now is so long lgb tqia two spirit goes on and on and on all these folks in as many disney movies as possible they that they want these characters to become ubiquitous in the disney movies and i, I think that is totally unnecessary and out of line i don't want you to work out your wokeism on my kid okay do a movie that teaches tolerance kindness support for your fellow human beings don't shove Two spirit people, which, by the way, is not a thing. And pansexual, I had to look it up. You know what that means? It means you're attracted to everybody. So you're bi, I guess. That's that's not a thing. That's already a thing. They already have a letter. <laughs> I'm sorry, but please, all these glommers who just want attention. It's a new thing. Remember the Willow Smith one? And she was like, I'm this thing that means... Um, I just I only want to have sex with people I care about. Well, you mean normal? That's normal. <laughs> anyway, uh, it's good to know. I appre- we owe a debt of gratitude to Carrie Burke for being so explicit about their plans, uh, and to certainly Chris Rufo for letting us all know about them. Beware, you beware. Don't put a Disney movie on in front of your kid before you fully come to understand what it's going to be promoting, who it's going to be starring, and what agenda they're pushing. They're no longer the Disney of yesterday. Hey, thanks so much for watching. If you like what you just saw, hit the subscribe button for more clips and full episodes.